What's going on guys, it's Sparks here and I'm here with another tips and tricks video. Today I'm going to show you how to jump into a multiplayer game pretty much every time uh, in Battlefield 4. So currently uh, the multiplayer um, is having a bit of server issues. Um, EA and DICE know about it and they're doing everything they can to fix them um, to the point where they're not releasing any further DLC until they have done fixing and stabilizing their game. So um, two of the issues I find are if you go into quick match and you choose one of the following, um, you're not always thrown into a game of that type. So for example, if I choose obliteration, um, I'm not always thrown into an obliteration game match, which sucks because the reason I'm coming to quick match is to play a specific game type and get into it immediately. Uh, part 2, server browser. Not really effective. Majority of the time, either servers are full, they're not marked properly, or you'll click on them and nothing happens. Uh, and then you'll get an error that says, fail to join, blah blah blah, blah 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 blah. Um, so, a lot of people, I've looked into it, and a lot of people say that this is the case, that uh, it turns out, you know, um, a lot of it's currently sort of broken right now. So, a quick, easy way to get into a game pretty much every time is, one, use your computer, or two, download the Battle Log app on your iPad, iPhone, or any other device that's available on. I'm not sure if it's available on Android, uh, but it's worth a try. So, uh check that out um, what you want to do is uh, you want to jump over to your PC and um, go to the battle log app so I am going to go to my PC and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about give me one second and I'll be back alright guys I'm here on my PC and um, as you guys can see, I've loaded up the Battlefield Battlelog website. So it's battlelog.battlefield.com slash BF4. Um, as you guys can see in the top corner. Now you can tell I am playing and it knows that I'm playing on my Xbox One because right below my soldier it says Soldier Xbox One. Also below it says you are online in Battlefield 4 on the Xbox One. So uh, there's two ways of getting to the server browser. Either clicking on the servers which uh, this little blue bar is the same little blue bar you will see on your iPad or your iPhone if you are using those at the moment. Uh, so go ahead and use this button if you're using an iPhone or an iPad or if you're on the PC like I am just go up here to multiplayer and go to server browser your server browser will show up you have your recommended servers up top if any of them are a server that you want to play on um, go ahead click join you should be jumping right in instant if not and you want a specific game type so here as you guys can see I've chosen for it to only show me all of the the maps that come with the regular game none of the DLC currently uh, none of the game modes I've chosen but you can choose if you want a specific game mode um, server to come up you can select one of those um, and I've also chose to show pretty much all the free slots and uh, official and ranked and then I can come up here if you've changed any of the settings and you can refresh the server browser which I'm gonna do right now um, and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna choose uh, official EA East uh, just for an example to show you guys that um, this works so uh, official EA East let's go to join server now as you guys can see you should be joining that server, that exact server, on your Xbox right now. Um, the way you can tell that is you'll see that the server number is number 275044. Somewhere on your screen it should say that you are joining server 25044. Or in my case, I joined Large Conquest on Rogue Transmission Normal. And right now what is loading up is Conquest. It never says Large in, on the loading screen. And we're in Rogue Transmission. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully it's really helpful. And um, I want to thank you guys for a lot of the success that my last video had. Um, I'm glad it's helping a lot of people. I'm not sure what's wrong with Call of Duty to you know clear things up. Uh, so hopefully infinity ward will fix that whole nat issue being strict in call of duty but not on the xbox one so uh if this video has helped you 
Um, feel free to leave a like, a comment, or subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Again, thank you guys for all your support. Hopefully this video has helped you guys. And again, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.